Damn, bro. That, only that one guy's not max level, bro. Jeez. A lot of cod. Oh, oh, that should have been good. It's nutty. What is that? That was a car. Hey guys, you probably want the class setup I have for this uh, Mark II variant, but uh, hate to break it to you, it's not a Mark II at all actually. Uh, we're gonna head on over to the class and then we'll begin to talk more about it there. So for everyone that's been asking me, whether it's in my streams on Twitter, TikTok, Instagram, or anywhere really, what I'm using in game on my R90, here's the attachment list. We're rocking the choke. Attack laser, VOK, slug rounds, and stipple grip tip. As to is this the most optimal build for the R90? Probably not. But this is very fun to use. It acts very much so like a sniper. So with its 14 rounds within the magazine, you can do a lot of damage. Honestly, you could probably get a way bigger, longer feed than you can with the Mark II and car swap class. Decided to experiment with it the other day, and um, I'm thoroughly surprised. That being said though, this gun really isn't the greatest, I'm gonna be honest. It seems like it's such a god tier gun, and to a degree it is, you know? But it's not the end all be all. There's definitely a lot better options, a lot more consistent options, and you guys will see what I'm talking about when we get in game. So another thing I forgot to mention, I do run this class, specifically with the Mark II alongside it, not the car, which most people would probably pick over the Mark II. I just want speed. And with the car, I just don't want to be slowed down with it. You know, I'm already being slowed down by the fire rate of the R90 that I need something to offset that. And that being said, I decided to choose the Mark II. And here we're using the new Mark II that just dropped alongside the new Operator Morte. Um, but, you know, that's not the star of this video. So, see you guys in game. Well, we got into a game on Condor Hideout. As you can tell, it's not the same time of day as it was earlier. It's mainly because, uh, it's not. Uh, I didn't fall asleep because the lobbies were so bad earlier, and this lobby is not much better, to be honest. With you. And, uh, so we're just trying to make the best of it. I'll try to get some highlights, but honestly, I'd say give this gun a go. It's not amazing by any means, but it's not terrible either, you know? You just gotta sort of get used to the learning curve of it. One tip I do have though, since it is a slug round, I'd highly suggest aiming a little lower. Because the slug really tends to shoot a little bit higher than of which you're aiming. So uh, just aim a little lower and you'll be one shot at a consistent range. And we're going against the T2P. Four second we have a team. Watch out guys. Look at these guys. CDL fucking gods no one can touch them but anyways how have you guys been doing today hope you guys are doing well hope you guys uh ate some pretty good food today hope you guys slept well you know the usual sort of stuff um as to the thoughts and other things about this gun so while i do get bored a lot of the mark ii car combo it's always fun to go try out different weapons because of the possibility that it can occur Bro, they're actually playing to win. Wow. You see the old fucking freaks or something else. Anyways. So, I don't know. I just like to spice it up every once in a while. Switch it up with the weapons of which I've never used before. Like this, aren't I? No. I leveled it up before, but I never really used it. 
So there's that. Let me mute my teammates. I love you guys, but I don't want to hear anything. That being said, though, I don't know. I've just been experimenting with different guns. And with that said, this is one of those guns I've been experimenting with. Is it a great option? Is it a great alternative? Not really. No, not at all. I do not recommend anyone take this gun seriously because it is just not good, you know? But fuck it, if you're willing to uh, tank your KD a bit, just a little bit, you know? But um, yeah, if you're willing to do that, then go for it. Fuck it. Nothing stopping you. Yeah, it's only about all I really gotta say about this thing. It's cool. I don't know. It's hard to have fun in this game, especially with how the maps are built, due to skill based matching. Like, it's genuinely not much fun at all. But, uh, here we are, trying to make the best of it. But, there's not really much to uh, make the best of. You know? These kids are gonna jump shot, drop shot, do all of the above, everything in the fucking book. I don't know what that was, but fuck it, it's going in the video. So there's that. Hope you guys enjoy that. <laughs> yeah. So you can do stuff like that with this gun. Back to the topic at hand though. See, you can do some really wacky and cool shit with this gun, but it's very far and few in between. Because right now, honestly, I'm not trying. I'm not really leaning forward. I'm just having a good time. I just uh, finished my uh, Travis Scott meal from uh, McDonald's. I thought it was a fucking joke until I actually went and ordered it. And I'm just here like, wow, this is real and not some sort of fucking meme. Well, it's also a meme, but you know what I mean. You know, for these kids to be in a forest stack, trying to win and everything, like they're the mini huntsmen, they're not very good. I'll be honest. I'm not very impressed with the, how they're playing. Not in the slightest. Because they're at 9 kills, 27, 14, and 2. I'm at 36, and I'm just here just not even using a brain cell. I'm just kind of vibing, you know? Living. Doing my own thing. And yet they're doing whatever it is that they're doing. So it is what it is. It's fucking Modern Warfare. We only got a few more months of this thing, and uh, then we're into Cold War. <laughs> Bro. It just, it's funny to see people try to play like the pros, but just kind of fail in the process. You know? Like they can't even do that correctly. Or maybe just go this match, we can ruin it all time anyways. So it doesn't really make much of a difference. So there's that too. Here, I thought they'd take it out of Cold War, but uh, the answer unfortunately is no. They didn't. They're keeping that bitch in. And honestly, it's alright. I don't blame them. Not even in the slightest. Look at that. It takes an M4. Two M4s, actually. Even though the first guy didn't really shoot me at all. But, uh, yeah. That's what it takes to kill me. I'm fucking around. So there's that. Yeah, if there's anything you guys really want to see from me compromise, let me know. I'm down to pretty much do mostly anything. Uh, upload schedule-wise, I haven't really thought of one. I'm just kind of vibing. Whatever happens, happens. But uh, whenever I come across another gun, of which I think is fucking hilarious, stupid, and somewhat usable, oh, I'll definitely post a video similar to this, you know? And if you want updates on what I'm doing, what I'm using and 
what I'm thinking of. Just follow my Twitter. That's probably the social media I'm most active on. And if uh, you don't want to follow me there, I'd suggest following me on Twitch, Instagram, and uh, TikTok. Because uh, I think I'm funny. Sometimes. Not all the times. But if you want some entertainment or laugh at a dumbass, uh, come to the right place. Because I am uh, the jokester here. Oh, teammates, can you clutch that? Please tell me we can clutch this. We're at. Oh, come on, come on, please. Please, no, 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 no. Oh, we got it. Oh, for the love of God, can we do this? Oh, we fucking can't. No, 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 no. Let's go, baby. We came back on these CDL fucking nerds. <laughs> Um, yeah, that, that's really about it. This, this is a pretty whack gameplay, but, uh, hope you guys enjoyed. This. Not bad. Not great, but not bad. Anyways, I really don't have much else to say. By the time you guys are seeing this, though, I'm most likely live on Twitch. But, um, honestly, I hope you guys take care. I love you guys. If you guys could uh, drop a like, leave a sub, I'd greatly appreciate it. And uh, until then, it's uh, Cecilio, Cypher, Refik, whatever the fuck you want to call me. And uh, until next time, take care of yourselves. See you soon. Love you. Bye.